Elizabeth Strout's Pulitzer Prize-winning novel, Olive Kitteridge, is a collection of interconnected stories that portray the lives of ordinary people living in a small town in Maine. The titular character, Olive Kitteridge, is a retired schoolteacher whose blunt and often abrasive personality masks a deep sense of loneliness and isolation. Through her interactions with the other characters in the book, as well as her own inner struggles, Olive's story becomes a powerful exploration of the complexities of human nature and the ways in which we cope with life's challenges. The novel is structured as a series of 13 stories, each of which focuses on a different character or set of characters in the town. While Olive appears in each of the stories, sometimes only briefly, the focus is not solely on her. Rather, the stories serve to illuminate the lives of the people around her and the ways in which they are affected by her presence. One of the central themes of the book is the idea of loneliness and isolation. Olive, despite her outwardly brusque demeanor, is deeply lonely, as evidenced by her strained relationship with her husband, Henry, and her difficulty in connecting with others. Her attempts to reach out to others are often rebuffed, leaving her feeling even more alone. This theme is echoed in the stories of other characters as well, such as Denise, a young woman who struggles to connect with her mother, and Henry, Olive's husband, who feels increasingly isolated as he ages. Another key theme in the novel is the idea of connection, or the lack thereof. While the characters in the book are all connected by virtue of living in the same small town, they often struggle to connect with one another on a deeper level. Olive, for example, is estranged from her son, Christopher, and finds it difficult to connect with her former colleagues at the school where she used to teach. Similarly, the other characters in the book often find themselves struggling to connect with family members or friends. This theme is perhaps most powerfully expressed in the story Tulips, which follows a young girl named Julie as she navigates the aftermath of a school shooting. Julie is desperate for connection and understanding in the wake of the tragedy, but finds that those around her are unable or unwilling to provide it. Throughout the book, Strout's prose is spare and evocative, with a keen eye for detail. She uses these details to build a rich and nuanced portrait of small-town life in Maine, from the changing seasons to the idiosyncrasies of the local characters. Her writing is both poetic and precise, capturing the beauty and brutality of everyday life in equal measure. Perhaps one of the most striking aspects of Olive Kitteridge is its exploration of the human psyche. Through the experiences of the various characters in the book, Strout paints a complex and multifaceted picture of what it means to be human. The characters are flawed, often deeply so, and their struggles with love, loss, and loneliness are all too real. Yet, there is a sense of empathy and understanding that runs throughout the book, even in its darkest moments. In conclusion, Olive Kitteridge is a powerful and moving exploration of the human experience. Through its richly drawn characters and evocative prose, the book explores themes of loneliness, isolation, and connection, painting a vivid portrait of small-town life in Maine. Strout's writing is both poetic and precise, capturing the beauty and brutality of everyday life with equal skill. Ultimately, the novel is a testament to the resilience of the human spirit and the power of empathy and understanding to bridge the gaps that divide us.